Hi friends, welcome back to Arc Tutorials. This is MongoDB full tutorial series for beginners. Today's episode, we will focus on how to do sorting of documents in a collection. More often than you will uh, expect yourself, but you will find yourself asking for data which is in sorted order from the database. Especially if you have a UI interface, if it has grids, tables, more or less you will find yourself making that request to the mongodb and saying give me sorted order of documents in a particular way welcome back friends this is part 18 of mongodb full tutorial playlist the playlist link is in the description box below uh, there are around 21 tutorials that i have planned today we are on the 18th uh, episode we have covered all most of the areas of mongodb if you have missed out on the previous episodes may, make sure you go and check it out so that you don't have a break in your continuity of learning if you have any doubts drop them in the comment section below i will try and help you the focus of today's topic is sorting so sorting right so we need to send data um, in a logical order before we pass it to the uh, ui or to the middleware or to the api Right. So sorting is pretty simple, straightforward, just like how we saw limit and skip. Uh, we will have to do something like db.collection.find.sort. Right. Uh, then followed by the key name. Right. So let me show you that. Let's get started. So I have my database, which is testing DB show databases. Right. And I'll say use testing DB. And then we will say um, so this is a DB. So if you want to make sure which you are in, you can just type DB. All right. So now we'll say DB dot leads. That's our collection name here. It has four documents. Now let's just do find, right? So it is giving me find. When I do find, it will give me all the documents like this in this order, which is the default order. Now I'm saying no. I want by lead name, right? So I want all the sorted by lead name. So we'll say leads dot find dot sort this is a method which will take a key now what is the field name you want to sort so you are saying lead name now here remember there is a value one or minus one right so i'll show you that first so let's do this so now you see it is sorted from top to bottom right b is at first m r s right so b m r s right so that's how it is sorted now you can also do minus one, right? So when you do minus one, what happens? It will be reverse order. S R M B, right? So you can, when you, so there are two parameters, either you can pass one or you can pass minus one. One means ascending order, minus one means descending order. Now you can do that with any column, right? Now let's say you get a request from uh, the API which says no sort by city, right? So you can give city. Now you will see NMD, right? Because we have given minus one. Let's clear and now pass one. So this is ascending. So now it is DM New York, New York, right? So this way you can pass on any column that you want using and you can return the document set. All right, that was simple, quick tutorial. Make sure you Practice it. These are small things you should be knowing. You should be aware if you're, especially if you're preparing for an interview. In the next episode, we'll learn about creating indexes. Yet another important to optimize your queries, especially when you're working again with a middleware kind of an API integration, right? So I'll see you in the next episode. Please do like, share, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much.